You're watching a Fox 13 News special presentation, The Gift of Hope. We have time for one more story about a young woman who's been on the wait list for four years who could be close to getting the gift of hope this Christmas. 20-year-old Truk Tran is a student at the University of Utah. Hoping uh, to further my career in the finance and accounting field. Truk looks like any other college student. She loves the games, loves to snowboard, and while she appears healthy, she was diagnosed with lupus. At the age of 16, she was told she needed a kidney. I think I would be like depressed and sad and stuff now if I didn't have the support that I have with my family and friends. They've been really supportive. They've been like researching about like dialysis and kidneys and they've been a big advocate. Hi, Trug. How Hi. are you? Good. How are you? There are frequent trips to the doctor as she waits for an organ donor, and each night at home before bed, she has to do dialysis to clean her blood because her kidneys can't. I hook myself up to this machine, and the machine has some dialysis. It's like a bag, and it fills my peritoneum with this dialysate and it does that for like nine hours at night. Trug also loves to travel but she can't with dialysis and unlike other college students she has to be home each night plus there is always a high risk of infection called peritonitis. It was the most painful thing ever I had to be like carried to the ER and I was in the ER for a week. To get off dialysis, Truk needs a kidney. She talked to Dr. Thomas Challey, a local transplant surgeon who could be her doctor if a kidney becomes available. After four years of waiting, both she and Dr. Challey is hopeful it will soon happen. It changes their lives completely. They're able to travel. They're able to uh, go on with daily activities. They're able to ha you know, hang out with their family members and lead a normal life. And uh, I think the joy that we're able to give them in that regard is, is just something that can go unmatched. So, to be an organ donor, all you need to do is say yes on your driver's license or state ID card, or go online and sign up at www.yesutah.org. Also a good idea to let your friends and family know of your wishes. It's been my pleasure to share these stories with you and to meet so many wonderful people here in Utah who have given and received the gift of hope. Thanks for watching, and have a happy holiday. Fox